Following the trajectory of Moore's Law, the semiconductor industry has transitioned from microelectronics in the 1980s and nanoelectronics in the early 2000s to today, where we have entered an era of atomic scale dimensions. At the atomic scale, with only tens of atoms at stake, there is no margin for error. Every atom matters. Which is why developing the most advanced technology presents such an unprecedented challenge for chip makers. Increasingly critical in the making of state-of-the-art semiconductor devices are deposition and edge processes, which involve gases or ions reacting directly with the wafer surface, often using plasma to make reactions faster. For decades, these processes have been performed by delivering all of the reactants to the wafer at the same time for the duration of the process. However, in the atomic era, these processes are increasingly difficult to control and for the most advanced structures, they simply won't meet the requirements anymore. The breakthrough that was needed can be found in atomic scale processing, where we can achieve greater control by separating out the reaction steps. In atomic layer deposition, or ALD, two adsorption steps occur in sequence to produce a conformal film, even on high aspect ratio or three-dimensional geometries. While multi-step processes tend to be slow, we can make them faster by quickly switching between the individual steps and using plasma. After many years in the laboratory, ALD has become productive enough to be a mainstream technology. However, the etch counterpart, Atomic Layer Etch, or ALE, has been much more challenging to bring from the lab to the fab. It turns out that it is much harder to atomically remove films than it is to deposit them especially when you need to etch directionally. But at LAM Research, we found a way to make it happen. The ALE process is based on the same concept as ALD in that the reaction steps are separated. ALE typically starts with an adsorption step to form a reactive layer, followed by a removal step called desorption to take off this layer. Using ions allows for the directional etching required to form deep, narrow structures. One of the biggest challenges for ALE has been throughput, and this is where ALE benefits from having ALD as a predecessor. Fast switching between individual steps and the use of plasma are the keys to this process. LAM's patented first-generation ALE technology joins our existing portfolio of ALD tools. Today, both ALD and ALE are part of the increasing trend towards the atomic scale processing required to enable new technology nodes. In order for our industry to evolve, the way we develop and produce our technologies must evolve too. Our atomic scale processing innovations are just one more example of how LAM Research is staying at the forefront of the latest technology, where the only limit is our collective imagination.